Iguanas are not likely to win any awards for the most cute and cuddly creatures of the Galapagos Islands any time soon, but they are undoubtedly among the area's most intriguing wildlife species. Galapagos iguanas vary from island to island in terms of size and color, from the striking red and green of the Christmas iguana subspecies on Espanola. To the brilliant orange and yellow hues of the Galapagos land iguana, but for us, the marine iguanas were by far the most interesting of all. There's no denying the fact that marine iguanas are seriously freaky. They look a little like miniature Godzillas, hissing and sneezing in order to expel excess salt from their nasal glands, and tending to clutter en masse like kittens. Like land iguanas, marine iguanas are thought to have evolved from the more typical tree iguanas, adapting over the course of millions of years since they first washed ashore from the rivers of Ecuador's mainland. Charles Darwin was notoriously revolted by the iguana's appearance, writing in his Beagle Diary, "The black lava rocks on the beach are frequented by large, disgusting, clumsy lizards. They are as black as the porous rocks over which they crawl and seek their prey from the sea. I call them imps of darkness. They assuredly well become the land they inhabit." Marine iguanas, which are endemic to the area and currently listed as a vulnerable species, can be found pretty much everywhere in the Galapagos. But they really seem to love congregating on the island's lava-strewn shores, where they can rapidly absorb heat from the sun to warm their bodies after a swim. On land, they may appear a little graceless and clumsy, but their flattened tails, shortened snouts, and spiky dorsal fins make them a wonder to behold in the water. It's extremely bizarre to be snorkeling and see a three to five foot long lizard feeding on algae and seaweed twenty five feet below you, then shimmying their prehistoric looking bodies like snakes to swim to the surface for air. But after a few encounters with this rare and remarkable species, we quickly came to love them, treasuring their crusty cuteness and their puppy like penchant for being constantly underfoot. In the end, the marine iguana's evolutionary adaptations provided an endearing reminder of the remarkable biodiversity that makes the Galapagos Islands so unique.